On this day dedicated to love, we are seeking inspiration from upstate couples who've managed to keep their love and their bond alive for many years. Recently, we met Paul and Tammy Nottingham, who moved to Greenville from Massachusetts about two years ago, and they love the life they're building here. We were both sergeants in the Army. Uh, we actually met in South Korea in a duty station. So uh, we, well, I saw her and said, hey, yeah, she's cute. <laughs> And uh, we started dating a little bit, and unlike uh, most of the military people that were in South Korea at the time, we weren't grumbling about where we were. We took advantage of, of uh, the opportunities to go traveling and seeing things. It's one of our common interests is traveling and seeing things. We love the Greenville area. We uh, both have different hobbies. <laughs> yeah, it helps a lot, yeah. She says do something, I say yes, ma'am. We have uh, different backgrounds and uh, a little bit different tastes, but we have a lot of similar tastes. Uh, I, I'm into computers and electronics and fix-it stuff, and she's a crocheteaholic. And I also knit and sew and do fitness here. Paul and Tammy Nottingham offer their advice and what they've learned after being married for 41 years. Remember your vows. Uh, marriage is not a is not a cakewalk. Uh, love is work. You have to work at it constantly. We're active churchgoers. I have a lot of good memories. I, I'm very proud of my children. Uh, it meant a lot to me to be a good wife and a good mother. That meant a lot to me. I've had jobs. I've worked all kinds of jobs, but my first job was those two things. Um, make your spouse your priority. Take care of them. Um, treat every day as a gift. And every day for us has been a gift.